I'm demonstrating now another tension relieving suture pattern called the far near, near far. It's uh, similar, quite similar to the near far, far near, except constructed somewhat differently. Um, this is far, near, near, far. So the first bite on the near side of the, the pattern is um, far away from the, the skin edge. Noticing that, notice that I am using the skin portion of the daisy. So that's far from the skin edge. The second bi bite is near the skin edge, hence the name far near. Notice that I'm resetting my needle. Um, generally these suture patterns, such as the far near, near far, uh, are used when there's uh, conditions of tension and so oftentimes you have to reset your needle in between bites. The third bite is near the skin edge. And the fourth bite is far from the skin edge. You can see that the suture bites are vertical um, in nature, meaning vertical from the as from the perspective of the uh, surgical incision. And I've taken care to make sure that the end of my suture and the swagged on portion of my suture are on the same side so they don't cross the, the suture across the incision. You can see how nicely that takes up the uh, tension on the skin portion of the daisy, although you can still see that there's a gap. Because of that gap, I'm going to tie this using a surgeon's knot comprised of a surgeon's throw followed by a simple throw. That is the far near, near far suture pattern.